Hello, this is Mr. Huff. Let's take a look at this problem really quick. So the first thing we need to do is identify the volume of this concrete pad. This concrete pad is 12 feet by 16 feet. So what we will do then is take uh, 12 by 16. And a typical concrete pad is 4 inches thick which is equal to 0 0.33 feet thick. So we're going to multiply that times 0.33. So we have length times width times depth. When we do the math on that, we get that the cubic feet for this pad is 63.93 cubic feet. The next thing we need to do is convert that into cubic yards. 63.93 cubic feet divided by 27 because there are 27 cubic feet in one cubic yard. And that gives us 2.368 yards cubed. So when we order, we're going to have to order 2.5 cubic yards because the smallest amount you can order is half a cubic yard and since we have this 0.368 we have to round up to the next half all right so that's the first part now we need to think about rebar rebar comes in 10 feet sections let's talk about this layout a little bit first so right here we see that they are spaced at two foot intervals across the pad. We also see that there's a little gap right here from the corners. You don't want the metal to extend past the footing or you know, past your concrete. So this has got a three inch gap all the way around. Let me highlight that. All the way around, we have a three inch gap so that no metal is exposed to the elements, okay? Rebar comes in 10 feet sections. So the first thing we're gonna do is lay out our 10 feet uh, pieces. So we are gonna count one, two, three, four, five of these spaces because they are 10 feet long. Let me change colors. Okay, so here we go counting the 10 feet pieces. One, two, three, four, five. So there we've got our first piece is 10 feet long. We have to go to a total of, let's think about our total length here. So we have 16 feet, and we're going to take away 3 inches from each end. So that means we are going to have 15 feet 6 inches when we're done. So here is the first piece. Here's the second piece. The third piece. Fourth piece. Fifth piece. Sixth piece. Seventh piece. So going left and right, 10 foot pieces, we have seven of those. Then we need to go up and down. And when again, we're gonna go five of these spaces because they're 10 feet long. One, two, three, four, five. So we have one, two, three, four, five, six, Seven, eight, nine. So we have nine going up and down. Now we need to think about the pieces to close all these gaps here. So let's talk about this for just a moment. This piece right here, it, we have to have a six inch overlap. So it has to be, it has to make up the difference between 15 and a half feet and the 10 feet we've already put down. So let's just go to a little math right here. So we have um, 15 feet 6 inches minus 10, 0. And that gives us 5 foot 6 inches. And then this gap right here, we have to have an overlap. So we're going to add 6 inches. So that means we have 6 feet total. Okay. So this blue piece is six feet long. One, two, three, four, 
five, six, and seven. Over here, six foot pieces. We have seven of those. And if you, we buy them in 10 foot sections, so that means we have seven four foot pieces left over, okay? So we're actually using the six foot piece, not the four foot piece. Now, if we look down here, so right here we have 12 feet, so we're gonna take away six inches from 12 feet. That means this is 11 feet. Six inches. And then we're gonna subtract 10 feet. And that leaves us with one foot, six inches. We need to add six inches before the overlap. So these are gonna be in two feet, zero inches long. Okay, so I'm gonna put these in with blue. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. We need nine two foot pieces. I'm gonna change colors. So these are gonna be our two foot pieces. We need nine of those. But if you look right here, we can use these seven, cut them in half, and get our two foot pieces from the scrap right here. So that means overall, we need this seven, this nine, and this seven. These three together will give us our total. So if you add those up, you need 23 pieces of 10 foot rebar to make this pad. All right, that should be all for that.